What's up, Nail Geeks? I am back with a uh, somewhat short sort of video today as I uh, catch up on previous released collections. I have Night Owl Lacquer's Almost Autumn Collection. This one released last weekend. They are stunning. So let's dive right into the swatches. First up is Be a Fun Guy. This is a warm brown filled with pink to gold to green Aurora Shimmer. So the shimmer particles to this are what I consider of the larger type. So I would classify this one as being a somewhat foily sort of finish and it builds very easily. This has a strong metallic feel on the brush strokes and for opacity, I'm going to suggest between two and three coats, depending on how you polish and the length of your free edge. This is very shifty. Indoor lighting, you're going to see this strong bronzy sort of appearance with an easy shift over to somewhat pink but then a dominant gold at angles this dries on flat so you're seeing a glossy top coat and next is if only it was always autumn this is a midnight blue filled with orange to copper to gold aurora shimmer i am in love with blue polishes i always say that but i really really enjoy blue especially deep blue bases with some type of shimmer to them and this is right up my alley so the shimmer is what i would consider again on the larger particle size this one seems just a touch more scattered and less opaque in terms of shimmer compared to be a fungi and for opacity i'm going to suggest between two and three coats depending on how you polish this is beautiful again very very shifty easy shifts over to that orange and then coppers and golds and next is I've been waiting for you. This is a linear hollow burgundy with red to copper to gold multi-chrome shimmer. Every once in a while we get these lovely super metallic strong linear holographics and I always get really excited to see them because I feel like there are so many polishes released that have you know everything in them. So I really appreciate just straight up shimmers, straight up holographics, what have you and uh, this is definitely one of those. The dominant look to this is that beautiful linear rainbow effect the shimmer gives it this really nice glowy sort of appearance but it doesn't overtake the rainbows and it has a wonderful wonderful smooth formula to it so i think two coats is going to be great for most and again finish off with a glossy top coat and next is autumn daydreams this is an olive green filled with gold galaxy hollow micro glitters so I am stoked for this one. I love glitter polishes, especially micro glitters. I mean, obviously you guys saw my custom, uh, but uh, I'm hoping we get more finishes like this one. So I'm really fingers crossed that we'll see more, maybe even like a red for the holidays or anything like that. I digress. So this is wonderful, very jelly-like formula, but easy peasy to build up. I think two coats is going to be perfect for most and finish off with a glossy top coat. Now this one dried down in such a way that I didn't find it to be textured, say like a Zoya Pixie, um, but I went in with a somewhat thicker glossy top coat and I didn't really have any issues with texture. And next is the cream of the month, Summer's End. This is described as a rich purple cream. Now, I want to really make this strong disclaimer that my bottle was damaged in a heat shock in transit. I'm thinking it was sitting in the mail vehicle probably for a little too long, and we are very hot here in the South. So uh, I'm thinking that that's what happened to my bottle. I spoke to Lindsay about it, and uh, she said she's going to ensure that your bottles are not going to have that issue. However, other than the bottle looking like that. The polish, as you can see here, applied perfectly exactly what it was supposed to. This is a really wonderful royal purple. Now these are all currently available in Night Owl Lacquer's shop. I will link you guys to that as well as the Facebook group if you want to see additional swatches, all that good stuff. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.